case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In 2014, the New York Court of Appeals heard the case of Colson v. City of New York, which dealt with whether a municipality like the City of New York could be held liable for negligence if it had a special duty to protect certain plaintiffs from harm. This special duty would require a special relationship between the plaintiffs and the government entity, showing the government voluntarily assumed a duty to exercise reasonable care towards them. Jandy Colson obtained multiple orders of protection against her abusive husband, Samuel Colson, and called the NYPD when he threatened her with a screwdriver. The police, with Jandy's assistance, apprehended Samuel and escorted Jandy to a domestic violence services organization. Later, Officer Reyes informed Jandy that Samuel would be sentenced shortly. However, Samuel eventually stabbed Jandy while picking up their son from school. The Colsons filed a negligence action against the City of New York and the NYPD, claiming emotional distress and that the police had agreed to provide protection. The court initially found that there was a triable issue of fact regarding the existence of a special relationship between the plaintiffs and the police officers. However, the court also determined that the child did not meet the criteria for the zone of danger theory, as he was not near the incident and did not witness it. The case ultimately hinged on factual disputes about the justifiability of the police officer's actions. The appellate division's order was modified, the case was remanded for further consideration of unresolved issues, and the decision was affirmed without awarding costs. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law, elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.